Hey guys, welcome back to today's video on Dark and Mythic here. And yeah, welcome back. So on the last video, as you heard me, we did had a fight between the Iron Golems and you know and you know the zombies, the skeletons and the and these people. And they some of them did ran out just like these. But today I'm not talking about the fight, right? And yes, this is this was built by me. This was not spawned. But today I'm talking about the map I spawned up. Um, I think this map which I spawned up is a really lucky place to have um, a to have a speed run or some kind. So if you're a speed runner and you're looking for a map, I think this is a great seat that you need to check out. So make sure you watch the full video. I'm gonna give you a tour first and then at the end of the video I'm going to give you the seat number so you can write it down and check it out for yourself just so you know I don't know if this map is available I am playing on the PlayStation version of Minecraft which I believe that this can also appear on Bedrock version I don't know about the other version but without further ado let's get started so first of all your spawning point that's why I did it that's where I did the arena but I spawned all the way around here you do spawn at this little swamp right here so I spawn like around I don't know I don't, don't, don't remember but I spawned somewhere around here maybe like here I was like right in front of this trees and it looks really normal but let me just give you a tour and let me talk to you about first off we're gonna start off with uh, that there is a lot of caves around here right there is several deepness of caves just like these that have plenty of iron and so you know it's a great starting point because you know you have first off three different kinds of wood including the swamp wood which I think is the same as this one and the birch wood and you have a lot of caves that are not this thing apart that have coal and iron and yeah I think that is pretty good as a starting point uh, but now I'm gonna teach you the other things Illuminati has way more things one of these things is that it has a stronghold and let me show you where it is it's somewhere around here no let's first check out the mountains and now there's something about the mountains oh by the way there's also this huge deep cave it's a really deep cave let me tell you this I did put some torches down here but yeah it's a really cool place to go it's big and huge so you need to totally check this place out and I think I am lost here already yeah so it's right here but yeah now let's go to the mountains because there is something so after that you can run all the way to the mountains and in these mountains hidden within is a nether portal it's one of these um it has you know three shovels that's fantastic as the flint and the flint and steel already as well as some iron arms so yeah this um a great place to start in i think i just said i'm gone the iron ingots yeah but yeah this is a good place to come here and you know if you already have some obsidian and if you need obsidian there's that log down there now let's go to the one which I think I did show some of the snippet. It's not for speed running, but this is for those who do want it, and that is that there is a woodland mansion. I know how intense it is. It's literally just right off spawn, and there is really a woodland mansion just like a few hundred blocks off you, right? Now this wouldn't be a lot for speed running, but it's really rare find these woodland mansions and mostly if you, it's at spawn right so there's literally a woodland mansion right here and that is not all this is just a bit of what I'm showing you you also have this biome but now let's show you other cool stuff you also have that little cave down there but I think what I want to show you it's right here and that is this stronghold right here plenty of lava really deep 
but there is something general that I do want to show you and that is if you start going around here you're gonna find a cobweb around here and if you follow that cobweb and oh okay there it is follow this cobweb you're gonna realize that this is an abandoned mine shaft with plenty of chest with rouse and golden apples and I think this is a great place to come speedrun because you now have this huge place where you can go up and down and then you can h literally hide here and get a bunch of materials just you know this is a huge place I did put some torches by so I don't get lost but it's a huge place and there is a lot of chests and yeah I sometimes get lost myself like there's a chest and whoop I, there's a chest right here this is the same one so yeah there is a lot of things to explore look there's freaking diamond right here and there is what is this blast protection one so you know it's an abandoned mine shaft and it's again it's a great place to literally um go and find out plenty of stuff and I don't know where I came from yeah I forgot where I came from it was from here but yeah and then I think went up here um and then now here I think so okay yeah thought I was lost so yeah that is the stronghold part but that is still not it not it all right beyond these mountains beyond these mountains it's something that a lot of speedrunners and I've seen Dream used it a lot. It's behind here and that is where is it? Did I lost it already? Feel somewhere around here and here it is. It's the desert temple. It's such a great place to get your first stuff. Um just you know don't press the things and oh I pressed it, never mind. Yep. Okay. And you might not want to press that. And yeah, there are several biomes. Next up, we have a pillager. Right? Also such a great place to go. And yeah, there's with the iron golem trap there. You know, there's the woodland mansion with pillagers. And there is villages over there. And I think there is a few more around over there. And if I'm not sure, I think I also found something. So as you can see, a lot of rivers, very abundant. And in here, I think I found something else, which you know a lot of people might fall in love with. And that's if I find it. Well, yeah, you know, there's that village too and I think I might not found it I think I forgot where it is but there is oh I think it's around here I think I found it um yeah, I'm not I'm not I don't remember really but there is another of one of those portals so if you have a diamond that you have from the mine shaft and you go to the other portal part which is somewhere around here I don't feel like going and literally searching but yeah if you find it you can literally go back and place some of the blocks with the new obsidian and you can literally go into the nether that quick right and yeah there's like there's some the village here oh and here it is it's here right so if you get the obsidian from here and connect it with the one in the mountains you can get it and right now we have found like three villages and yeah so it has three villages it has two one of those portals as one desert temple with wood I mention one mine shaft and I'm pretty sure since it's a pretty lucky area that there can be a stronghold near but I will not let y'all like it's you totally need to check this place out and this is more recommended for speedrunners so yeah thank you guys for watching this video the seed is going to pop right now I'm gonna leave it for about 10 seconds check out the number do whatever you want 
and make sure to check this seed or map out or however you call it if you're gonna speed run and yeah it's a great place or not necessarily speed run but you know if you just want to be uh you just want to feel like i have a lot of stuff together you can literally make a home in the plains have a lot of stuff so yep yeah, that is the end of the video thank you so much for watching and i hope you enjoyed and just so you know nope this is not part of the map this is something i built check out my last video too if you want to see what i did last time and we'll see you next time bye bye <laughs>